my drive and my twist. Now, if we don't drive right until the point to where we rip the foot out, we're gonna lose it because he's gonna get his outside foot up. Again, as the attacker, what are two important things that we've already talked about that help me finish every leg attack? Both feet in the head. Head and what? Head and drive leg. So, as I'm turning the corner, come on, JP. As I'm turning the corner, it is very important. He's on this single. Stuff the head, clean the grip, skip the knee. Okay? As I get to the corner, this 90 degrees, and I hook this hip, he understands that this still has to come up, and that has to stay stepped up. So the battle is, when I get here, how can I beat his position? As I drive with my butt, what happens to his drive leg knee? Goes to the mat, right? When his drive leg knee hits the mat, that's when it's real easy to spin out, okay? What we try to do is get the 90 degrees, he's still got his drive leg up, and then he can still wrestle there. If JP tries to spin out right here on me, and he just gets lazy, I get this outside foot up, I'll finish on every time. That's the best, that's the best finish for a single leg spin out. Okay, we get through all these positions. I'll show you a bunch of anti-scramble stuff that we've been working on, okay? But we gotta make sure that that drive leg can't come up. So it's not just turn and dive towards his back. Can't be that simple, because we're talking about the best guys. He's gonna keep adjusting. Stuff the head, clean the grip. That's why we can't just drop straight down anymore, because we've gotta get this grip below, so we gotta skip, skip the knee. See how it kind of jerked him forward? That's important. His drive leg knee is still up. I gotta get to 90 degrees, and my butt is a bulldozer. Hook. The hip drive, and then right as I get a good angle right here, watch my chest and my head as I turn and rip. Did it drop? Did my head and chest drop? Nope. I want my head and chest up, feet right back in the mat. Get in athletic position. I might have to wrestle there. I might have to wrestle there. I can't just dive behind him. Watch what happens when I just turn and dive behind him. I get here, a lot of times we get anxious and do this. Now he's got my foot up in the air. Now he's got an angle. Now I'm back in the hornet's nest again. So I want you to drive low with your butt, and right when you feel the most pressure as you're driving, turn and just rip that foot out. Questions? Do not get 90 degrees and try to rip it out right here. It'll never come out. I've got to drive, 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 twist and rip. Head and chest stay up. I should end up in a sprawl right behind me. Questions? Anybody need to see it again? Good, let's go.